Hey, what's up? Today I'm going to be going over how to get the Sega Mega Drive to turn into a Sega Genesis on the Raspberry Pi 3, running RetroPie 4.3. Alright, first thing you're going to do on your keyboard is hit F4 and that's going to take you to Terminal. And from there you're going to enter sudo nano forward slash opt forward slash RetroPie forward slash configs forward slash all and then forward slash platform dot cfg alright so this is a config file that we just created so it's empty right now but we're gonna we're gonna put in what we need to to get this change to happen so we're gonna write mega drive underscore theme equals and then in parentheses we're gonna put genesis and then just hit enter and do the same thing mega drive underscore platform and then equals parentheses genesis and after you get that in there just go ahead and control x and then yes and then enter and that saves it and if you go back to emulation station wait for this to load here you can see it's still mega drive but we're not finished yet so go to your settings and then go to RetroPie setup and now you're gonna go to update all installed packages and then just keep hitting yes or ok to start it And once this process starts, uh, just prepare for it to take about four to five minutes. I think this ran for a little over four minutes, but I sped it up to about 15 seconds for the sake of your time. And as soon as it finishes, you're gonna see you get another prompt telling you that it's done. Just hit okay, and then you can exit out of here. And just go to exit. And then Still got Mega Drive, that's because we got a reboot. So you can just restart it whichever way you feel comfortable. I chose to press F4 on the keyboard and do the CD reboot, but you can just press start and then go to quit. Either way, it'll get you where you want to go. But as you can see, we log back in and we got Sega Genesis. That's what I'm talking about. So we achieved what we set out to do. So I'm going to go ahead and fire up the game and I'll put it in a little bit of fast motion just to just to blow through it real quick. So I'd like to thank you for taking the time out to watch this video. I hope you found it useful. And if you did, please hit that like button. Also, if you haven't subscribed, do so because I'm going to be putting out new videos each week. And if you hit that little notification bell, you'll know when they're dropping. Thanks for watching.